Appointment is at quarter to five, and it's not even four o'clock yet. And I'm already in Weinberg, which is close to where my author's practice is. And I'm sure he's going to be impressed that I'm really early. So I took a chance, being that I'm obviously an hour early, and I thought that I would just wait in the practice and read a book. Right now, I'm reading the Power of Habit again um, by Charles Duhigg and oh yeah I was just gonna be reading that book while I waited and then my author could see me and this took about five minutes and it's not even four o'clock yet so I was in and out my new date to see him is on the 14th of Jan so that kind of explains that I'm not gonna get my braces off in December and I mean, I'm not really disappointed. I am loving my braces, so I don't mind it. I just want to know when am I going to get it off. I did ask him when mine will be coming off again though, but he made a joke of it and said that he'll be keeping me forever. So, yeah, I don't think that it's anytime soon. It's day two and it's actually not as bad as I thought. I don't feel any pain and I think that I can actually eat things today. Right now I'm eating chewing gum against my author's wishes, obviously. So, um, we'll see because I haven't actually eaten anything substantial yet. But I'm about to go get coffee now and we'll see whether I can actually chew something. Hey, it's me again. So it actually wasn't so bad. <laughs> so it actually wasn't so bad. I'm able to eat stuff. I can actually eat toast as well. Wow, guys, I know this looks lazy, but I'm actually just really tired. I had a Muay Thai session last night and it was so amazing. Like, I really enjoyed it, but the downside was that obviously my energy is low today and the one thing I always forget to mention is how painful um, not painful really but it's like really irritating when um, I just get my bands changed then my bands are so tight that it actually rubs up against my lip and I need to put a uh, wax on it so right now when I'm speaking, I literally don't want to speak. It's not that I'm in a bad mood or like I don't want to talk to anyone, but my lips are constantly rubbing up against my bands and I have to put wax on it sometimes. Um, but then I can't eat because if I'm eating, I might swallow the wax. So then I need to take the wax off again and put the wax on again. And I'm just like, it's such a mission. So I just don't speak rather, but like this is so annoying. Just imagine you were, I don't know, you had like a spoon in your mouth and it was just like stretching it like this the whole time. <laughs> this is like a weird explanation, but just imagine it was stretching your lips the whole time and you would normally get a like a, a stinging feeling at the side of your mouth that is what's happening to my top lip right now like here all over here so that's like really painful anyway so i've been speaking like this i've been speaking with my mouth wide open and it looks like i'm so happy but it's actually not that i'm like i am happy but i'm just also exaggerating my smile because if i speak lazily if I speak lazily if I 
if I drag my lips against my teeth, it's so painful. So I'm just trying to avoid having my teeth close to my, having these bands close to my lip as much as possible. I don't know if I'll lift it, if you can see, if there's like redness. Ooh, I've got a nice pimple there. Just want to show you. Like here, you can see. Well, I suppose it's... <laughs> I'm so gross. <laughs> oh my word, I'm so gross. I hope my future husband's not watching this. Anyway. Um, yeah. So, but look how my teeth is... Look how my teeth has moved, eh? My teeth has moved. My teeth has moved so much. It's so beautiful. And it looks different. Still have a little bit of a gap this side. Yeah. But it's moving quickly. <laughs> so yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one.